Okay, uh, this is a fun game I found off the Mac App Store. It's called You Probably Won't Make It. Um, I went ahead and played it a little bit, but I erased my data so I could set a sort of start from scratch here. Um, basically, you're- I don't really know how to describe this. You're this little person here. You can double jump and move left and right. That's pretty much your only function here. Why am I not- There we go. Um, you have to basically get through here. Um, people would find this frustrating, a lot of people, but I actually find it pretty fun. Um, it keeps your blood on the screen permanently, uh, to remind you of your shame, and, uh, that line there, that white line, is my previous path, uh, from the last time I died. It only keeps, like, one, though, so, like, the, your most recent death, basically. Um, I just thought people might find this a little an interesting game. I'm gonna start raging. I think I only rage, though, when I'm actually, like, really trying to find something out, like, uh... Oh, first of all, I don't know if I rage. I, don't... I almost never rage, but, like, legitimately rage. Um, yeah, oh, why did I miss that? But, yeah, this is a really, actually, fun game. I think it was, like, either a dollar or free off the Mac App Store. Which I think you can get for Windows, I'm not sure. You can get items on Windows, I know that much. Yes. Yes. Oh! This is a really fun game, you're a little black person bald guy with feet and one eye and a little mouth, but he doesn't work. He just sits there and listens and doesn't really- He just dies, pretty much. That's all he's capable of doing. He has a sad life. Okay, yeah. Um, I got through this level. I got through a few levels, and what I, uh, what about the- that. What I remember about this part is when you get to that highest platform up there, um, you don't want to jump in between, but you actually double jump both ways just in case anyone actually wants some kind of strategy with this game. I don't know. This is like an indie indie game, so I doubt anyone cares. <laughs> but yeah. Okay. Up. Okay. Okay. Well, anyway. This isn't really like a game with a specific, like the Beans game. I was doing Beans Quest. I was more of like, sort of a plot, I don't know. Something more adjective-y, I don't know the adjective. Um, I guess I'll kind of share a little bit about myself. Uh, my name is Joseph. I'm a, uh, I live in New Hampshire. I was born in New Hampshire. Um, I, uh, I've been a gamer for actually a, a really long time, uh, ever since I was, like, a little kid, like, little, little kid, um, I've been playing, like, uh, not, like, you know, serious games, if you will, but, like, kind of, uh, I just remember when I was, like, what, seven, six, seven, eight or so, um, I had a GameCube. The first game system I ever got, I believe, was uh, the Game Boy Advance. I played like Donkey Kong, uh, Mario, stuff like that. Um, uh, eventually, I just remember I got a game. I had a GameCube. Um, I used to love those. Uh, played Mario Kart, Super Mario, Sunshine. Those were great games. Uh, I guess you could consider them classics. Uh, we also had a PS2 back then. Uh, we played this game called, it's old game, Jack and Daxter. Uh, I really love that game. I still do, except I don't have my, well, I don't use my PS2 anymore. I got a PS3, uh, after selling a bunch of old games. That's a long time later. Uh, so eventually, you know, one Christmas, I get a Wii. Um, and it, before that I got like a DS, I don't remember exactly, but uh, I got a Wii eventually, I really liked it when I was younger of course, and then uh, 
for some reason, Halo, um, I always wanted to play Halo when I was a little kid. I don't know what, like, appealed to me about it, but I always just really wanted to play Halo. So eventually I, uh, got an Xbox 360. Um, I still play my Xbox 360. Uh, it's just, you know, I have friends play it with me. Well, obviously. Um, I'm dying here. Like, really, what can I... That looks like an elephant. That's so... Oh, never mind. Um, but, uh... So, yeah, that's pretty much my gaming background there. Uh, oh, and... Uh... I don't know if this is really... Something to... Well, I don't know how to put this into words correctly, but, like, we've always kind of been, like, a Mac family, if you will. Um, my dad, he's just not good with Windows, and personally, I gotta agree with him. He doesn't like Windows. They get viruses way too often. I know I had one. Um, maybe I was just being stupid and downloading crap, but, you know. Well, both, but, uh, Macs basically don't get viruses very often. Um, well, obviously it depends on what you download. I mean, I'm not gonna be like some snotty little Mac fan saying, Yo, Macs never get viruses ever, because they're God or something. But like, um, I'm sure that they have written viruses for Mac. I'm just saying they don't get them very often. The downside to having a Mac is that, um, especially for someone like me, is that all those games, like even Steam, like Terraria, Fallout, Oblivion, Skyrim, whatever, pretty much every major brand game you can get on Steam or whatever, you cannot get on the Mac. It's not compatible. So, <laughs> it, it's really unfortunate ish, if you would. Like, it just really sucks. Because uh, I wish I could play, like, Fallout and stuff. I'd love that. That'd be, like, the coolest thing, but... Because I've always been, uh... I like messing around with, like, the cheats, and, uh... I love Fallout, Skyrim, or more of the Elder Scrolls, but, you know... Uh, that series. It'd be just... I think it'd be cool to have the console commands and check that stuff out. Wow, how did I... Okay. Um, so this will probably be my last level for a while. Um, I just figured, you know, since this is like, what is it, my, some teen or something, like 12 or video or so, um, I wouldn't be a complete stranger to anyone who happens to find my videos. I hope someone does pretty soon. I'm getting like no views at the moment, but, uh, yeah. Um, thank you for, uh, oh, wow, right there, um, hearing, listen to me, uh, ramble on for a while, uh, you can ask any questions you might have about whatever in the comments, I don't care if it has any significance or not, like, for example, something about my cat eating waffles, I don't know, um, what am I saying? What am I doing? Anyway, yeah, thank you for uh, listening to me ramble and watching me repeatedly die in this game that you probably won't make it in. Whatever. So true. I'll probably pick this up some other time. And, uh, please make it. Thank you for listening to me ramble about random crap. I'll see you guys later.